So the action underway, Ian Lins. In the red single, James Mancini in the blue. One man, ten seconds remain. Four to zero still for James Mancini. And there's the fireman's carry. Scoring four points feet to back. He leads eight to zero. Now going for the fall, he's got 52 seconds. Ian Lane's trying to stay off his back. And Mancini, who is the former national team member, secures the fall and wins this match at the 57 kilogram weight class. Le gagnant bleu de Montreal, James Mancini. <laughs> Up next, the mask machine in red from Wesson Wrestling Club, Emily Hessler. And in blue, our blue, the London Western, Natty Parks. Well, all you students out there, I know you got pizza in your hand. Some noise for these two athletes as they head out here. And we can start in the wrestling from the Western Wrestling Club. And in the blue singer from London Western Wrestling Club is Maddie Parks. Warning going to Maddie Parks. Should the blue see what? seconds remaining. And 
Parks is being worn to action. She's going to be put on the 30 second shot clock. So a scoring action must happen in this 30 seconds or be a caution against her and a point for Emily Kessler. Nice, Sam, nice. 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 Yeah. Way to go, Emily. Action out of bounds, but two points scored on the first takedown for Emily Kessler from Western Wrestling Club. That stops that 30 second clock because points were scored during that time. Four points. Nice takedown, able to come in through. score. Don't forget if you are tweeting about the Canadian Wrestling Team Trials, use the hashtag CanWrestle15, the hashtag CanWrestle15. Also make sure that you are following the mascot Johnny Singlet for all the behind the scenes action of the Canadian Wrestling Team Trials. Good snap from Maddie Barnes, trying to work in behind Emily Kessler, trailing by two. And no point scored. Back to standing. Another 30 second clock put on Maddie Parks. She leads four to two, but a scoring action has to happen in the next 30 seconds, or she will be penalized with a caution and a point given to Emily Kessler. Go. 
Heavy Wizard by Kessler. But she's unable to score. One minute, one seconds remaining. Eight to six now. Jake Parsons in the red singlet, Kate Ritchie in the blue singlet. Once again, the winners of all these matches are moving on in this pool format. It's a single elimination tournament.
So it's Larissa Dilemma from Team Impact in the red, and Linda Moraine from Montreal Wrestling Club in the blue. There's a leg attack by Murray, nice catch by Dilemma. Here's a single leg by Murray. And she is able to score two points on the takedown. Nice chest pressure, now looking for more, looking to lace the angles. Defense from Dilemma. Linda Moore able to hold on to that arm, prevent her from fully getting control. No points scored, 115 remaining in the first period. Big throw from Linda Moore. Trying to secure the fall, lots of pressure down. Tough fight from Larissa Deleva. So it's an all Bears Wrestling Club matchup. Christopher Kent in the red, Mashke in the blue. Is Kristen Paquette. And it's going to be a verbal warning against Amber Mashley.
Now it's a verbal warning for Chris and Paquette. That's one each. Catching her is Amber Mashing. Had double unders on the shot attempt now going for the fall. And she will secure the fall. And win this match in the 58 kilogram weight class. Once again, your winner in the blue singlet for Bears Wrestling Club, Amber Mashke. La In the red ceiling, Jordan Steen in the blue ceiling. It's the 86 kilogram weight class. Jordan Steen wins this match 10 to 0. 
Le gagnant en bleu de Montréal, Jordan Steve.